Hello, this is Freedom X5. I said I would do some Pokemon Go videos, and well, I'm gonna. This is my first official YouTube one. I started one, and then uh, let's just say uh, I got a call, and I didn't want that to show up on my uh, on my videos, so I had to start over. But there was a few things that um, I wanted to talk about other than Pokemon Go. One is the new uh, policies of YouTube because I know for a fact after they review uh, about maybe all my videos they're all going to come down because the fact is YouTube now has a policy to where you cannot cut square basically You can't say what you wouldn't say around a little kid. Um, I am a level 17, and I am on the red team. Here's my stats. It's nothing to front, nothing to uh, basically shout home to, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna. give you my opinion on the YouTube situation and talk about Pokemon Go at the same time, hopefully. But, uh, one Pokemon that I, oh, I wanted and thanks to my cousin, I was able to get was this little one right here. She was one of my favorites in the Pokemon world. Hydro pu Water Pulse, not bad. But, like I said, I don't have, I'm not, on my account, there's not much to talk about other than fact is I'm working on it and I don't get out much. I haven't played much of Destiny since uh no, it's traffic. Come in. Hello you watch out for dead gins bit Yeah, I wanted the cuts right there, but I didn't. I guess I can control myself. But, uh, on the YouTube thing, I just don't see those policies lasting long because I've seen a lot of re responses from other YouTubers and they basically say the same thing I'm going to say is YouTube is basically limiting their themselves and making it so you can't do much on YouTube anymore. One guy actually made the joke, uh, YouTube is just gonna become another kid's channel. Like PBS. He used to be like, well, if they do, they do. Finally, I'm in range. Trying to put my best of red here. And you may be wondering why I didn't put my 
Babe Florian in there. It's because I'm gonna be doing this. Mm -mm. Man, Scyther, you're not as powerful as I thought you'd be against her. And I'm going to tell you this, this is where I ran away. I'd rather run away and live the fight another day than uh, put everything I got into it and die. Uh, especially since I'm only going up against my own team. But, yeah. When it comes right down to it, from what I've told, could see from Pokemon Go so far is it's gonna die out a little fast. To be honest with you, and unless they do an update of the how you find Pokemon, they're pretty much asking for people to stop playing. To be honest with you. But as you can see, this is was the latest update to their location, and it, all it says is this was in the nearest area. Now, what I was told is it's within two, if within a block, if it's on your radar. I'm just like, uh, well, I walked the whole block and never found a Pokemon that was on my radar. I wish I was recording the other night when I was out with my cousin because we were basically there was Pikachu just sitting on the side of the road and we couldn't even find him. That's how basically useless the location is. But I don't live too far away from this gym, so I can keep an eye on it pretty easily. I've captured a few on my own, and little trick I learned the hard way is. You wait until you got at least a good 10 in there, and it'll give you like 100 points. But, yeah. I have a feeling this gym ain't gonna last long just because we're the there's only two of us in there, and one, one of my cousins is a yellow. And, uh, well, let's just say he, I have a good feeling he's going to go to that gym because he knows who, my user ID, and he, let's just say he loves messing with me. Oh. But, yeah, I can usually stick uh, around here for the 10% power until I got 10% power. Let's see over here. Weezing Bell.
Oh. Ah. Uh, I was really hoping it would let me go in there. If I got, if my guy was moving close enough. Yeah, that's one thing I hate. Is even though you're standing still, then you start moving again, your guy's gonna jump halfway across town and back over to you. But. I heard there were a few things that they were banning people on. I've, I haven't had a single problem because I've basically been taking this thing slow and still getting used to some of this stuff. YouTube. And on the YouTube thing, like I said before, these policies are basically going to die out soon because the fact is half of, actually 90% of the YouTube community actually cuss. Then there's music videos that are, that are from artists on, uh, on like rap videos and all that. That's gonna be, uh, they're gonna cut those out. Because, hell, if you're gonna ban an average Joe's shit, then you should ban the pros shit too. Now, I'm not a big YouTuber, I'm not. Dado and all those guys who got millions on millions of views and people following them, but I'm small. I'm a small time YouTube. I YouTube when I can. And on my last stream, something came up and I had to end it. Really? Let's see if uh, tacos in here. Nope. And by the way, I've seen it, and I've heard other people complain about it, but uh, there's a big hoo-ha about um, Team Blue. Is there um, a bunch of big cheaters? And I've seen it around town. Just because the fact is... I've seen blues do, uh, um, do, uh, lures, and this one lure, I kid you not, lasted a good hour. And no joke. 
I sat there for an hour. Did I benefit off it? Yeah. Did I feel happy about it? No. But yeah. Most people They say, oh, just leave the cheaters alone, they'll go away, they'll get caught, they'll get banned, well, I can tell you this, when you got a low level, I don't care what it is, if you got a low level, and you're taking out a high level target, I've seen this millions and millions of times. I've seen it in GTA, Destiny, Call of Duty, matter of fact, and in War Commander. And now I'm seeing it in Pokemon Go. Low levels basically one-shotting a high level. And I don't care what anyone says, that shit ain't right. Now I'll be, I'll be frankly honest with you. I have played with those people in GTA just for the hell of it. Yeah, they gave me explosive rounds. I had my fun with it, but I didn't abuse it. Yeah. I used it to snipe someone one time, but cheaters never win they say but truth is they always win especially in a game like war commander and that's why I really haven't done videos about it because the uh, company that basically runs the game the company that runs the game they uh, They're corrupt. And I'll be frankly honest with you, they are. And if it wasn't for the fact of all the time and energy I put into that into War Commander, I would have stopped playing it a long time ago. Hell, that's the only reason why half of the uh, people who play War Commander still play high levels like us. It's because we put enough time and energy into it where we're pretty much we gave up now. It's pretty much useless for us. We like wasted. We wasted all that time on one game and then get nothing out of it. But, enough about that. Let's get back on the Pokemon Go. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I'll get this guy. I should have enough power to go around once.
I wonder why nothing popped up for me because I got I caught some pretty good ones on my last video before I, I got a call let's see here there we go I'll give you a little tip if you're going to be out Pokemon hunting the best thing to do is download the app to a non-cellular phone by what I mean non-cellular I mean make it not active to a phone number that way you can just uh, shut it, shut everything else down and conserve your battery on it, that. Me, I got about three different phones. One I use for my calling and stuff. The others I use for like my gaming and all that. And then I have one which at this point because of something that happened to it which I don't really okay we will we don't you want to have some fun okay I hate Weedle. My whole first few weeks of playing this game, nothing but Weedle. And that'll be a capture. The way you could tell is you could see the sky when you captured it. Sorry about this. Uh, it's mowing day for. Uh, uh, local uh, historical uh, building but yeah I'm not I'm not the best there are people out there better than me it's like in destiny but you know what like in destiny I give it 110% oh Pidgey uh, let's see. Here. Have a berry. Be my friend. I actually do have things I could videos I've caught on my phone of what I'm modder did in GTA but I rather not put that out there just because I don't like ratting them out yeah you got your good ones and you got your bad ones but yeah okay let's see here nothing really coming out so I'll hit I'll hit this pokey stop up here and if I don't see anything like that anything I'm just gonna go home which that means I'll be ending the video because I do not like to reveal my location you, even though you could potentially find where I live from this uh, from the locations you've seen on this video but you still could you all you could do is just uh, this ain't gonna be a capture Oh, proved me wrong.
but yeah. Oh, Sparrow, Weedle. Just go through my inventory real quick to show you. I pretty much used up a lot of the stuff I could use to boost shit. Okay, let's see here. Uh. Ah, squirrel. Too bad I can't bring up my snap. Scyther in real life and take out that squirrel. Make some squirrel stew. I was not raised in the country, but my pop was. Hi. Hi. But, yeah. Going around the corner. And nothing really good popping up. So. I just wanted to basically show you guys what I got at this point. Hopefully, be something good soon. I've got a few uh, Tardini, but uh, yes, I know I said that wrong, but uh. Uh, do this poke up activate already there we go well that's that for you Doesn't look like they're usually I got at least one rare that pops up around here. Let me go through show you what I do have. Like I said, it's nothing to bark home about. Yeah. Nothing really special. here but yeah well thank you for watching freedom x5 signing off see you on the other side